Field Ambulance was a mobile frontline medical unit. It was under the command of a division and had special responsibility for the care of casualties of one of the regiments in the division. The ambulance was responsible for establishing and operating a number of points along the casualty evacuation chain, from the battalion's first aid station to the regiment's aid station some 500 meters in the rear. During World War II, both the Allied and the Axis armed forces employed many types of field ambulance vehicles. Their purpose was to transport sick and wounded personnel from the front to the rear. Most were built on standard military cars and truck chassis to simplify maintenance, repair, and many were all-wheel drive or even half-tracked for use in rough terrain. As the need for ambulances increased, other vehicles, usually cargo trucks, were often pressed into ambulance service and converted in the field by adding stretcher racks and the requisite markings. There were several different types of military ambulances used by the German armed forces during the war, so the vehicles presented here comprise only a fraction, but may be considered typical examples. As per the Geneva rules of engagement, German ambulances, like those of Allied forces, were well marked as such. Opel was Germany's largest truck manufacturer. Although many people assume the Blitz name was associated with the Blitzkrieg, it was actually a model name first given to an Opel truck in the 1930s. The Opel Blitz was the mainstay of German military transport fleet. There were several dedicated ambulance models. The vehicle's delivery and cargo space held an ambulance insert, equipped with folding seats, brackets and hangars. After the invasion of the Soviet Union in June of 1941, the German army quickly found that Russia's road conditions and terrain were far from favorable to wheeled vehicles. So half-track trucks were de developed into ambulance versions such as the Opel Maltier or Mule. Probably the best field ambulance vehicle of the German army was the one based on the RSO tractor. Reupenschlepper Ost or Caterpillar Tractor East, more commonly abbreviated to RSO, was a fully tracked, lightweight vehicle used by the German army from 1943. It was conceived in response to the poor performance of wheeled and half-tracked vehicles in the mud and snow during the first autumn and winter on the Soviet front. Improvements in the mechanization and mobility helped in the endeavor to produce not only specially designed medical vehicles, but also to find additional solutions to help overcome needless transportation and unavoidable absence of military personnel from the combat zone. RSO was an optimal solution to transport wounded soldiers and more manufacturers joined the vehicle's production in order to meet the ever-increasing need.